Hello, my name is John, and I am here to show you how TapSpeak Choice works. We are currently on TapSpeak Choice 3.0. In this video, I will be showing you how to create your own boards and how to edit a button. In this, as you can see right here, I am on the new default home page of TapSpeak Choice, and as you can see, it navigates you to other boards. Right now, I have the voice Ryan as my default voice. But, to create a new board, we click the book icon, top left hand corner, and we press the plus button right here. We get title, dimension, your root folder, if the board should be modifiable or not, basically adding new buttons or changing the buttons on it if it's going to be your new home board what your background color should be and notes for it right now we're just going to call this this board YouTube just for an example right now it's not going to be exclusively to YouTube it's a 56 dy dynamic board that I have created and right now it is blank as you can see I have my message window up to change new to put new buttons onto it you click your library right now we're on the adjectives button so when I go back to my board I click that the book icon and then we click the little rectangle button right next to the filing cabinet button and there's the adjectives board we drag, let's just say bad, right there. And then fast, first, good, fast. oh, good. And there you go. That's a simple board right there. Now to edit this, these buttons, you can edit them directly from here. Oh, as you can see, I put that as my message window right now. And, uh, to take that out fast, you just hit backspace or clear. Right now, let's just say I want to change first to last. Even though we already have a button uh, for last, uh, we're just going to make first and to last. So, we press the pencil icon in the top right hand corner. It becomes a little play button. That indicates that you're in the editing mode. When you're in here, you press and hold first and you have speech editor image editor delete button and hide hide is a new feature of 3.0 when you turn on hide you flip that and the button is now inactive it's still oh I have the wrong boy YouTube there we go and now I can't press that button but I can press the other Good. ones now. Clear. Anyways, going back to editing it. We turn hide off. We go to speech editor. And let's put this as last. Last. Done. Image editor. And right here we have the PCS symbols. And since it's um uh, image is for first it's going to display all these first ones but we're, we don't want first right now we're going to want last L A S T return now we have all these new options for last but I like to stick figure your people so I'm going to click these and there you go we hit done and you have uh, changed the button but say you don't want it to be an image it can be just text so we just go back into the image editor and we can go to text and see how small it is right now for last we can change the size of it to so let's say no I'm not even seven let's go nine nine's good so we hit done 
and play and there you go created new last button with text now all right